This week we're in Whitby on the northeast coast where my great uncle, Count Dracula, first touched British soil in the shape of a big dog. I get a crowd together by the bridge and we play a numbers game. I need someone who's quite good at maths, just fairly good at half decent at maths. Excellent, great, come send me for me. <laughs> you just volunteered yourself, brilliant. Chap there, what's your name? Okay. John. John? Kayleigh. Craig, good to meet you. Come stand here, great. Okay, I'm gonna give you a small sealed envelope. Hang on to that for me. You'll need that in a bit. And uh, gonna give you a stack of cards there and a pen. Okay, so listen very carefully. I'm gonna ask you three each in turn to give me a two digit number, all right? You're gonna write it down on the card, each one underneath the last person's, all right? And when you get to write your one at the end, you're gonna put a line underneath it. Just make sure you leave a gap underneath so Haley can add them up. Does that make sense? All right, so. Look at me. There's a two digit number. So you can go through your mind and change and change and change. Keep changing your mind. This is about you now making a decision. Change your mind, change your mind as many times as you like, all right? What have you got now? 62. 62, thank you. Write it down at the top there. Kaylee, yes? Yes. All right, looking at me, just change your mind. Keep changing your mind, all right? Stop there. Change your mind again. All right, what have you got now? 35. 35. Okay, write that down. 35. All right, Craig, same thing. Craig, uh, two digit number, just keep changing your mind over and over again. A bit like a fruit machine, all right? So you get a number here, and then a number there like that. Look at me, look at me. Have you got it? All right, whatever you're looking at now, take three off it. Okay, what have you got now? 24. <laughs> Write it down for me. Great. Pass that down to Haley. Haley, you want to add those up, all right? Now, those were all three choices, correct? Yeah. yeah. None of you were coerced or persuaded into choosing those numbers? No. All right, what total have you got? 121. 121. Do you want to just check the addition there that that is correct? Somebody just check that? Yeah. 121. No. Will you open up the envelope for me? There's a three digit number inside. Can we get this? Call it out nice and loud. Shout it out. What is it? 121. Do you want to hold on to it this time? It's another sealed envelope. Yeah. Instead of two digit numbers, I'm going to ask you to think of three or four digit numbers. All right? Okay. Don't make up any numbers until I come to you individually. Also, I don't want you to tell me what the numbers are. You're just going to write them down. You don't even tell me. It's going to be a four digit number we're going to start with. Four. Okay. four digit. Now imagine it like a fruit machine. So we get a number like this that appears, a number like that. Okay, slow down a minute. Number like there, the first one. Second one. Third one. And the fourth one. Yeah. One, two, three, four. You can see the digits. Don't tell me what it is. You write it down nice and clearly on the top there. Please do not let me see. Okay, Kaylee, you're going to think of a three digit number. Three numbers. So you get one digit, another digit, another digit. Can you see those three in your mind? Okay, swap the last two digits around. You done that? Okay, write it down, write it down. Don't let anybody see. Craig. Yeah. Okay, now you've already got numbers in your mind. Don't do that, all right? All right? In fact, just, just take a moment. Just think of four blank screens. Get a number on the first one. Yeah. Second number comes up there like that. Yeah. Third number like that. Yeah. Look at me. Yeah. Whereabouts do you live? Pencil. All right, what colour is the roof of your house? Uh, red. Fourth one? Yeah. Excellent. Grab the paper, write it down quick as you can. Nice and large, okay? Large and clear. Don't let me see the numbers. Yeah. Done that. Yeah. Put a line underneath it so we can add it up. Can you take them from me? Don't let me see them. Okay, all right. And uh, who's our mask lady? Is Haley. Haley. Add them up for me. Can you please all check the addition? Happy with that? Yeah. What have you got? What's the total you got? 10904. 10904, yeah, yeah. 10904. All right, okay, you've got an envelope there. Open it up. Read it. Hang on, before you do, completely free choices, yes, those numbers? Yeah. What does it say? Nice and clear, what does it say? Shout it out. Look behind you. Look behind you? Yeah. On the bridge there. 10904. Oh, 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 oh. Congratulations. As you wait, 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 wait. What's the date today? 10. Of the? 9. 04. Oh, 10904, you even got the day's date. The amazing thing is, three of us can yeah. come up with three different figures day. and it comes up with today's date. That's just, wow, amazing. I'd seen them numbers all day not knowing what they meant and then I just realised. You always watch on TV and you always think, have they it's all been set up, are the actors? But no, it's really, I've done it and you're like, oh, it's really scary.